Now what's really great about Discover Dogs is the not only the passion, obviously you can see it, but the decorated booths. Um, here you got the Tibetan Spaniel and they've decorated their booth with the wonderful attributes of the breed. Um, talking about the temperament, the color, um, just the size, the general, and anything you wanted to know about the breed. It's basically displayed in the booth, but more importantly, the people are going to tell us about the breed. So why don't we come over here, if we can squeeze in here, and um, talk to some of these wonderful, dedicated owners of the Tibetan. Hi, my name's Heidi. I work for the Kennel Club. And um, we'd love to know more about your dogs. Well, first of all, what's their names? This is Lily, and she's just about, about the right size now, and this is a full coat. And that over there is a mum who's seven years old. Very intelligent and very inquisitive, <laughs> as you can see, but very gentle and very, what's the word you could say? Very friendly with children and very, not quite lap dogs, but... <laughs> and what's your dog's name? This is Dora. She's eight years old. And uh, Dora, so you guys are obviously here in the stand at Discover Dogs at Cross, really promoting the breed. What is it about this breed that makes it so fantastic? Well, it's just the character is about them. Not one dog's the same. We're all individual. And <clears throat> it's just... The way they are addicted to, you know, once you have one, you've got to have another. It's just something about them. So how many dogs do you have? Uh, at the home, there's 13. 13 dogs? Did I hear that correctly? 13 dogs? 13 and one Tibetan Mastiff. Wow, so you really are a dedicated breeder. <laughs> well, I show them and judge them, but yes, yes, very, de very dedicated to them. Are you an addicted breeder as well? Yes. <laughs> You don't want to know how many I've got. Uh, well, I'm going to ask, how many dogs do you have at home? About 30. <laughs> <laughs> so lucky number 13 here is Tibetan breeds. So um, obviously the wonderful attributes, they're wonderful dogs. Um, it's fantastic. You guys did a great job at the booth, I have to say, and uh, displaying the temperament. Because I think it's really important that when people are choosing a dog, they choose the right dog for their lifestyle. So what would be the right kind of lifestyle for this particular dog? They need to be part of the family. They shouldn't be left alone all day, every day. It's vital that they are part of the family, doing what the family does. They're a very adaptable little dog. They'll go for a long walk if you want to. They'll stay at home on a wet day quite cheerfully. But they um, are very much a family companion dog. They're very intelligent, very disobedient. So they're not for everybody, they're a very special little breed, but if you like them, absolutely wonderful. And as Andrew said, highly addictive. <laughs> well, I'm going to be careful not to get run out and get one of these because um, I may have an addictive personality, so I don't want to next year come back with 14. But they're absolutely lovely dogs, and thank you so much for sharing them with us today. Thank you. Thank you.